We apologize again for the delay in bringing you this number one contender match for Candice LeRae's NXT Women's Championship. Delay is a much nicer term than I would have used. You have to wonder if that interruption will throw either of these women off their game tonight. That's a valid question, but knowing the history they have with each other going back to last year's Mae Young Classic, I think both Red and Rhea will be more focused on the task at hand. Look at this. German suplex. I had the chance to tour the WWE Performance Center earlier today, which is not too far from us here in Orlando. It's such an amazing state-of-the-art facility. Oh, foot just stomping down. She says, no thanks. She's got to remember to get back in the ring before the referee's 10 count. And she's back in the ring now. Oh. Slap oh, man, face first. Not stopping the leg. Just nasty. Things taking a turn for her now. Yeah, but too soon to be worried. It's gonna hurt. Tear your hamstring. If you look up bad attitude in the dictionary, I'm pretty sure you'll see Rhea Ripley's photo right there on the page. Rhea Ripley is the walking, talking personification of a bad attitude. Uh, you can't look up bad attitude in the dictionary, Saxton. You can look up bad or attitude. I'll give you, Rhea Ripley certainly has attitude. It's like she's tapped into some unseen energy source. Wow. Oh, look at that. Oh, again. Not a good place to rest. Oh, not at all. Who's resting? Sneak up. Oh. Turn out the lights. The party's over. Three. Byron, you talk about Rhea Ripley's bad attitude, but in her mind, she's as happy as can be. There may be a scowl on her face when she's in that ring, but it's only a matter of time before that scowl becomes a smirk as she inflicts damage upon her opponents. Look out. Oh, my God. Oh, from the top. Rhea answers with a decisive big kick. That right, looks like that rocked Red. Red counters with a super kick. Both women are down. It's over. Hold on, both women's shoulders were on the map when the ref counted three. Oh, I saw two, can we get some kind of official ruling on this? Obviously, Rhea Ripley and Red both believe they won and deserve the title opportunity. So I guess we'll have to wait and see what happens next. What else could go wrong tonight? Here on NXT, it's dream time! And his opponent from Capitol Hill, Washington, D.C., weighing in at 227 pounds, Velveteen Dream. Mesmerizing, enchanting, 
And I can guarantee you that Dream doesn't have time in his day for you, Saxton. Just exudes cool. The real deal, this kid's got it all. The WWE Universe intoxicated by the dream. How can you not be? So charismatic. I'm not gonna lie, it's hard for me to take my eyes off him. It's dream time. What's he doing now? Byron, anything he wants, he's the Velveteen Dream. Uh, Corey, I think he wants you to go talk to him. If you missed the opening moments of our broadcast tonight, Trey called out the Velveteen Dream, demanding he be his partner for the upcoming Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic. Yeah, but you left out the part where Trey handcuffed himself to the ropes. Luckily, Velveteen had a key here. That idiot would probably still be stuck in the ring. Oh, let's not forget what Velveteen Dream said. If Trey can defeat him, Velveteen will be his partner for the Dusty Classic. There's a lot riding on this match. Oh, this guy Trey is only here because his friend got him a job. There is no way he's going to beat Velveteen Dream. It's not looking good for him here. He's got to get out of that corner. What an incredible move. He's certainly looking in command at the moment. That is a man possessed right there. I had the chance to tour the WWE Performance Center earlier today, which is not too far from us here in Orlando. It's such an amazing state-of-the-art facility. Great one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. It doesn't get much better than this. Situations like this usually don't end very pleasantly. Can't prepare your face for that. The running senton! Crushing impact. Oh, what a German suplex. Dream pops the shoulder up. Not yet. Oh, what impact. As we've seen countless times over the years, superstars oftentimes try to make a statement with their entrance, and I think it's safe to say that Velveteen Dream did just that, Byron, at NXT TakeOver Philadelphia. Yeah, and leave it to Velveteen Dream to bring out an entourage prior to one of the biggest matches of his career. Oh, dive! He's struggling a bit here. He's not looking great, but never count him out. situation to be in right here. Boom! Three! Back in from the floor. Trey 
Ray setting up for a suplex, but Velveteen blocks it twice. <laughs> Velveteen Dream hits the neck breaker. Maybe you'll find a partner next year, pal. And now he's going to the top. This might put an end to Trey's hopes of competing in the Dusty Classic. Do it, Dream. Purple Rainmaker. Thankfully, this is all over. Come on, cover him. What's the hold up? Wait, what's Velveteen doing? No, no. He's telling the referee to count. Velveteen Dream is letting Trey win. You gotta be kidding me. What the heck is he thinking? Why would you do this? Maybe Velveteen wanted to be Trey's partner after all. Who knows with Velveteen, but that guess is as good as any. I can't believe it. This dream just turned into an absolute nightmare. Velveteen's confusing actions aside, you're looking at the newest team to enter the Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic.